Man, these micro bees are something else. Can I get an amen on that? Everybody's running them around and driving around and looking for things to jump them off of. Well, here's your pro tip today because we're talking about DIY cardboard ramps. Welcome to CK4RC. If you do not have natural ramps or mass produced ramps, make them yourself. Take a cardboard box like so. I think it's pretty safe to say that we all have a lot of cardboard boxes laying around these days. Mark a line somewhere on this plane Mark a point somewhere on this plane, draw some lines, use a ruler, draw some lines, and then, so if you mark, if you have the equal distance on this side and this side, that should give you a 45 degree angle on both, both sides. If I remember the Pythagorean theorem correctly, that's what it is. And then if you use different measurements on this side and this side, then you should have different angles to jump off of. So let's test my middle school mathematical skills. Got my good old angle finder right here. Let's get it set, zeroed, come on now, it's zero. There we go, got it zeroed. Here we are. This is saying 46.6 on this side. It is a cardboard box, it's not. And then this side is saying 46.6. So it's actually, the angles are actually the same. And then over here on this one, we've got a good, we've got a cool 35.1 launch degree, launch angle. And then this side, probably gonna be tough to jump off of. Uh, it is an extreme 56.1. So that is how you take a cardboard box, you turn it into a couple jumps, and if you wanna get wider jumps, because these are really narrow, and lining up this thing is gonna be tricky, um, instead of cutting it the way that I did, you can turn the box and cut it width-wise, so you get wider jumps, but to be perfectly honest, I'm not gonna be using these or keeping them for anything. This was just to show a quick DIY how to make your own jumps for the best micro buggy on the market. And there's your pro tip time.